Well, caught in a lie tonight, the 7 Action News investigators dig deeper into City Council President Pro Tem George Cushingberry's recent traffic stop and his past. Investigator Heather Catalo is here now with what she's uncovered. Heather? When 7 Action News first learned that George Cushingberry Jr. got stopped by Detroit cops, we wanted to know why, and we wanted to know more about his driving record. That's when we learned the state had put a hold on his driver's license for unpaid parking tickets. Cushingberry told us that he'd paid those tickets weeks ago. Tonight we know that isn't true. And I went down and paid the parking tickets over four weeks ago. Oh. Maybe six. That's George Cushingberry Jr. last Thursday explaining to 7 Action News why the Secretary of State had a hold on his driver's license from unpaid parking tickets. Now the seven investigators have learned that Cushingberry's statement was not true. Records we uncovered show the new Detroit City Council President Pro Tem has been racking up city parking tickets since 2002. And as of last Thursday, when he spoke to reporter Ronnie Dahl, Cushingberry had not paid off his remaining 300 $173 in fines, despite what he said. And I went down and paid the parking tickets over four weeks ago. Oh, so maybe six. Seven Action News has confirmed Cushingberry just paid those fines in Detroit this morning, and the hold on his license has not been lifted yet. Last week, the longtime politician was leaving a bar on Detroit's west side with a friend when Detroit police pulled him over. Despite having a passenger with medical marijuana in the car and an open, empty liquor bottle in the vehicle, a Detroit police sergeant only ticketed Cushingberry for failing to use a turn signal. An internal investigation is underway. Meanwhile, the seven investigators are digging deeper into Cushingberry's history as a lawyer. In 2000, Cushingberry was accused of mishandling the money in Wayne County probate cases, and the court later barred him from being appointed to them. At the same time, the Michigan Attorney General also terminated his job as a public administrator for probate cases in Wayne County. The Attorney Discipline Board has also reprimanded Cushingberry twice. In 2002, they reprimanded him and ordered him to pay more than $117. In 2005, the ADB reprimanded Cushingberry again for failing to properly Properly administer two probate estates. He was ordered to pay more than $3,447. A reprimand is serious. It means that there's been a finding that you have not fulfilled your responsibilities as a lawyer, uh, and having two of them uh, is, is certainly of concern. George Cushenberry is also facing possible discipline for another matter that's in front of the Attorney Discipline Board right now that's likely to be decided this week. As for the false statement to us last week that he paid his Detroit parking tickets, we have reached out to both Cushenberry and his lawyer, his attorney telling us tonight that he can't speak to what Cushenberry told us last week because he wasn't there, but he says the parking tickets were in fact paid today. Stephen and Carolyn. Well, you can always play the tape for him and he can hear for himself what his client said. Thank you.